You clap your hands nine times and then clap the elbows inside this part, starting from the left hand nine times. And then you go to the right arm inside over here, the elbows, and the nine times. In the springtime, I just feel so sad. I don't know why I feel this sadness so deep inside me. Well, you know what? That is another signature of a springtime, especially for women. So in, um, in the women, in the springtime, and because this is a time of growing, this is a, a time of uh, 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 preparing yourself for pro production. So that sadness can help you to bring your energy, your mind, and your focus deeper into your system to activate the chi for production. So it is natural. So don't, don't feel bad about what you feel at this moment. So you know what? And in order to uh, balance this sadness within you, number one, there's a, a, uh, a few things you need to uh, um, you know, so put into your daily practice. Number one, so wear something red or have something the color red put around you like a mug and a red mug and, and a red painting with some color you don't have to be very very super red right there's some color and there is so with the red and that can help you to activate that exciting energy the fire within you so that's number one number two is in and here is this uh, exercise for you to help you uh, to activate the heart energy. Now, so here I'm going to show you how to do that. So let's do it together. Okay. Now, nine times, right? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now repeat one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That's it. First of all, I want you to tap the beginning of the eyebrows nine times by holding your hands in all the knuckles nine times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. And then the face. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, so now cut the top of the head. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Shut of the head. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Now tap the tailbone. When you tap, you slowly bend over, slightly bend over a little bit. Now the hip joints. Okay, now drop your shoulders, open your fingers slightly. Take a deep breath. Now close your eyes and focus on your lower dantian, which is deep in behind the navel. Take a deep breath. Now, so I want you to tell the universe and of course tell your body too, what is the purpose of doing this Qigong meditation together with me? You want to heal your arthritis, you want to strengthen your immunity, you want to help to balance your emotions, Say that aloud in your heart and you let the universe know this is what you want. And then you invite your masters to come in to help you 
sending you love and healing energy. Now you start bouncing the body, focus on your knees. Inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth, only in the bouncing. Let go with the shoulders. And take five seconds to inhale and five seconds to exhale. If you are in the process of healing something uh, chronic or um, strong blockages in the body, you can take like a, a three seconds, five seconds to inhale, five seconds to seven seconds or even 10 seconds to exhale. If you have difficulty in healing, I mean, in breathing that long, and you can, of course, do it in the way you feel comfortable. It can take like a two seconds to inhale, four seconds to exhale. That's okay too. Spring for Qigong practice, as always, comes from good, better, and best. When you do it, it's good. Practice more, you get better, and from better, you make it the best for you. Now have your hands up. Continue to inhale through your nose, exhale through your mouth. Put a smile on your face, feeling how good you feel, how wonderful you feel at this moment, practicing Qigong together with me, with so many your friends, new friends, old friends all over the world. Now you put your hands down. Turn your body from side to side a little bit. Relax yourself. Now bring your body back to the center. Stop, continue to bend your knees a little. Fingers are slightly open. Say in your mind, I am in the universe. The universe is in my body. The universe and I combine together. And you feel that your body and the universe are merging together as one. When you feel your body and the universe are merging together as one, how that feels to you. Bring the vision of you way, way back to the beginning of the universe, to the beginning of the creation of all beings, including human beings, how that energy looks like. Everything is so peaceful. Everything is so perfect. Now slowly you bring your hands up like a holding a ball in front of you. The size of the ball like a volleyball or basketball. Now you notice that you are holding your hands in this way in front of you. Fingers slightly open. And you bring your focus to the elbows. Now, starting from 
this moment on, you inhale and exhale slowly through your nose, if that's possible. Inhale, open your hands to both sides by moving your elbows first. Exhale, close your hands. Elbows move first, and then the hands, fingers follow. Inhale, you visualize the universal energy, the love and healing power coming in through the skin, running through all the gaps of the cells and organs and collects in your lower dantian. And exhale, see the light from your lower dantian shooting out from every part of the body to the ends of the universe. And then inhale, you drop your knees a little bit more. Exhale, slowly straight up your knees. Inhale again, slowly drop your knees a little. And exhale, slowly straight up your knees. Continue to Move your body and your hands in this way. Make sure your fingers are slightly open. And use your elbows to guide the movement. Use your hands to feel the tingly sensation, the chi flow. You feel the tingling sensation in the tip of the fingers. Do you feel the nice warmth in your arms, in your back? Do you feel there's a heat traveling along the spine? When you feel any, any movement like that, including Maybe you might feel kind of an ache and, ache and pain a little bit here and there while you're doing the movement. Each sensation, they are all the indicators telling you that channels in your body are opening up. And you are so happy to notice that. Say thank you to your body. Thank you to the universe for sending you love and healing to help you with the healing, with the balancing. And you feel so much joy in your heart. You allow this joyfulness energy to fill you up in your liver, in your lungs, telling your lungs and your liver and your organs how happy you are, how joyful you are, and how much you love them. When you say, I love you, my liver, I love you, my knee, by doing so, you are actually sending healing to that particular part of the body. And by doing so, you bring your focus back to your own body. When you bring your focus back to your own body, you bring chi to your healing, to that part of the body for deeper healing. Any time when your mind takes off, simply just bring your mind back and focus on the feeling of the body. And you can find just one spot to focus on. 
like a focus on the tingly sensation in your hand, or the warmth in your lower dantian. Feeling how good you feel, how wonderful you feel. Now, two more movements of this movement before we move on to the next. Inhale, open your hands to both sides. Exhale, close your hands. Straight up your knees. Inhale again, drop your knees. Exhale slowly. Straight up your knees. Hold the ball in front of you. Focus on your lower dantian. And take a deep breath. Now put your hands down. 